Now, I know since then that you have assumed more administrative positions and such, but yet you have remained consistent with an organization of paying nurses for a large number of years and has also uh, served as their president. Can you share with us in a broad scope why that organization is important and in general the changes you've seen in pain management over this time period? So I got involved with the American uh, Society for Pain Management Nursing back in the early stages. Um, pain management nurses really were um, individuals in their um, occupations in hospitals and that networking was so important. So early on in my career I reached out to other nurses who were in pain management because as I was going from an acute model to looking at management and chronic pain, I found I was in a field that was a little bit different. Um, so what became important to me was to network around a new area that um, I was involved in and reaching out to other people. And I think that's what the American Society for Pain Management Nursing offered to me. And then later on in my career, I got involved in administration um, for a hospital um, in looking at major acquisitions. And in part of those acquisitions, um, we were acquiring cancer services. And of course, pain management and cancer um, became a, a focus for me and wanting to find out more information for that. And, you know, what a better opportunity than to use my organization to reach out to folks for that. 